Alright, take a look at this, yes? When you guys are doing the elbow, when you guys are doing the elbow, so I'm here, boom, elbow down, yes? Take a look. Elbow down. Don't, don't open it up. If you open it up, I'm here. Basically, if it's strong, change your shift, shift your body weight. See how he can go through because there's no le leverage there. Yes, he can bend your elbow. So once you're here, as he changes his leverage, yeah, see how I shifted straight away? So that's why elbow down, elbow down. The closer the el your elbow is to your floating ribs or your ribs, the better because see that moves like that. For example, yes, can I have the knife? Take a look, yes. Traditionally, this is how you train. In see like how you train your footwork, yes? So they put a knife under your armpit. So look at my movement, it's still the same. It's not, I'm not used to this knife yet, it's too thin. So, so when it comes to attack, yes? Come to that. You see how I'm still moving with my hips? When it comes to attack me, he goes to my face. Sorry about that, it's all right. Okay, there, it comes again. Up cut. There. See that, he goes for a punch. There. So you know. You see that? Even when I hit them, I use my body. Listen. He comes to attack me. Punch, punch. Okay? See that? He goes punch again. See? That's it. So it's this which is attacking him, not this. Yes? Because I don't need to, I don't need to go. Boom. This is for your entertainment only. Yes? That's why I go big movement because it's familiar for you guys. Traditional see that. That's it. They hit below the chin. He goes for a punch. Punch. For you. Punch. Punch. You train yourself to get punched. Now, punch. You see that? So the thing is, when he punched my ribs, yes, you're actually learning his pushing pressure. Once you understand the pressure, punch. See that? See, I'm cut, catching it very close, but I'm actually cutting in. So he goes for a punch. That's it. That's it. And if you look at how I tuck, like this, like this, like this. Same like the blade. So I'm doing this, yes? He goes for a punch. See that? Punch. See? He goes for a punch. See? There. He goes for a punch. See that? There. It, it. So that's why, tradition in olden days, if you reach a certain level, once you understand how to read body mechanics, once you understand the basic interception, the teacher, if you're at a certain level, not everybody, they will put edge up under your armpit. Edge up under your armpit. So any friction, you'll be like, oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Yes? <laughs> so that's why it's always wax on, wax off. Wax on, wax off. And when they're attacking, that's why you have this. There. So imagine I have this, yes? So Ray, he comes to attack me. That's it, boom. He comes to attack me. That's it, boom. He comes to attack me, shield. That's it. Now, because you, you have this, yes? But, when you guys understand, that punch, see, you're there. He passed my hand, my hand. Thank you. See the setup again of the shoulder? That's why you have this. Again, there. This one. So you set everything up on the shoulder. He comes towards me, shoulders here. He comes to tight me, put the shoulder there. So whatever he gives me, the shoulder's there. He pushes my hand, extension of the shoulder. So I'm not trying to be faster than his, his hands. I want to coordinate my hands according to his shoulder. That's how we have shoulder, his shoulder, floating lips, hips. Shoulder, his shoulder, for three steps, same trick with his hands. So if I'm here, yes, punch, there. So it goes for punch, punch again, see, punch again, see, see, hips. He punches again, see, hips. He stands up, there, see, thank you. See how he falls, how you like it? Here's another. So with the knife. So now, look at the shoulder. See how he pull, pulls back, pull forward? Now I can extend. There, insert. Here, boom. This one, when you do this elbow, it's basically you guys are doing this. So don't go. Here, it should be. Right? I drop this, 
as if I'm doing downwards cut, and I thrust this back. Yes? Back. So that's why now I'm, I do downward cut, punch, downward cut, and you're there. Yes or no? Yes, yes? Yes. So now, with this movement, it's just that small detail I want you to do. So I hit this, this, uppercut. Yes? Then once you're there, drop, then cut his arm. He punches me, sector three. See, as I, as I do this small round, see how the wrist lock is there? Now cut through, and you go. Is that okay? Yes or no? If not, you can just stop it if you want. See? Cut. Finish. But do the follow up. Yeah. Cut. It's on. Right. See? Rest lock. If you don't like it, clear this. Shit. You do it to the front. See it? Turn it. So. Yeah? Yeah. I cut his arm. Look for punch. Look. Done next to you. Yes. Is that okay? Yeah. <laughs> He's not chilling already, no problem. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> but what you guys, I want you guys to do is, as you do this, boom, up extend. That, turn, cut his arm. So this is, he punches, look. That, here. Now when you're here, Hit past his groin. That's it. All right? But when you guys are hitting, imagine you're throwing a ball. Touch the yes. yes? So you go through the hips. So if it's here, yes? Here. Yes or no? Yes. So. So. That's it. That's it. Yes or no? So, you see how I miss? Thank you, thank you, thank you guys. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.